Welcome to MKT United. In this video, I'm going to show you how to activate your Stripe account. Let's get started. So first of all, go to stripe.com and and you're gonna see a website like this you already know then click on the right side on top there's say sign in so click the link then enter your email address and uh, password and hit the big blue button it says sign in to your account then when you successfully uh, sign in you're gonna see your dashboard now in order to activate just click activate your account button on the left uh, sort of towards the top of the uh, window then it shows account application this is where you fill in your business information to, in order to activate your account start with where are you based so by default it should be united states i think it's determined based on your IP address. Yeah, you don't have to change, just leave it as United States. Then um, enter your product information, basically what your business is about. So it doesn't have to be super detailed, but uh, um, make sure you are doing legitimate business and products. And uh, enter your website URL. Uh, HTTP uh, colon slash slash is already filled in so you don't have to fill in just um, enter your website address then when you scroll down um, there's a section you put your account details and here you need to select your business type which is a couple of options individual LLC nonprofit partnership and corporation and here I'm going to use, I'm going to leave as individual, but again, um, choose your correct uh, business type here. And next, uh, you're going to enter your tax ID. Again, this is important, so make sure you put right information. And uh, if you don't have it or you need to apply, uh, there's a link to apply online then it uh, brings you to our IRS um, website if you need one move on to um, business address section so enter your business address Now moving on to the next section, which is identification. Whether you choose individual or corporation, you need to verify um, your individual identity anyway. So in here, you need to enter your legal name, uh, full name, uh, first name and last name, and your birthday, and uh, your actual social security number. Uh, this is not tax ID. Again, this is your individual number. The next section is another level of uh, identity check. Um, there's three buttons on top. This is Facebook, LinkedIn, and Google. You can use one of these accounts to verify your identity. Just choose one of these and click and log in to your account. In here, I'm going to choose Google. Then try to log in your uh, Gmail account. That's it, that's all you need to do. So there's no complicated uh, process. Just uh, click the button and uh, login. As you can see, if you want to, you can revoke your login from Google, then try another account. This section is your credit card statement details. This business inf name information and phone number, it's gonna show 
on the customer's credit card statement. So make sure enter the correct information and the reachable phone number. In the last section and the most important section, which is the bank details. In order to receive money, you have to enter your bank details, then your bank account has to be a checking account. Then enter your routing number of your account and uh, your account number. As you can see, you, you need to enter account number twice to confirm. Find the information on your check or on your statement and enter and click activate account. That's it. This is how to activate your Stripe account. If you find this video useful, please subscribe my channel and hit notification bell. So when I upload a new video, you get notified right away.